hello and welcome to my channel today I'm gonna show you guys how to create a custom toolbar for example I'm a professional draftsman or you can say drafter or designer I work for a company in New York and uh, I just need uh, some tools for the specific job for the company I need few tools handy so sometimes I have um, I, I always use commands for tools but sometimes I need to click on the tools and uh, I need a custom toolbar so today I'm gonna show you how to make a custom toolbar by yourself and let's uh, jump on it so this is AutoCAD 2015 uh, any version you have you supposed to have those menus if this menus is not there just click on this drop down menu and click on uh, uh, show menu bar there is showing hide menu bar so let me let me hide it then maybe you, you are right now on uh, if you look at my screen in this area there is no file edit anything so I'm going to click on this to an uh, to enable I mean my menu bar so I'm click on the show menu bar and it is now showing those my menu bars so now I'm going to click on the tools then workspaces then customize guys take a one more look I click on tools then workspaces then customize tools from main menu then workspaces then customize after you click on the customize you can see on the on, on this area they have AutoCAD and some other tools so I'm going to click on this toolbar then I will right click on the toolbar then click on new toolbar so this area asking my new toolbar name so I'm going to give a new name so let's call Mm. Oh, what name I supposed to provide okay say my toolbar my tools okay so this is my tools and after I did that I just click outside outside of this area so it's become my tool so this is my toolbar and I need to bring tools here so let's go to those commands i need for example r e v c l o p d rev cloud it's not coming here okay so okay let's say a rectangular array so I need record uh, I mean rectangular array to my toolbar so I, I'll click this one and I just drag to my tool this tool is running so here is it so I have one tool in my tools rectangular array actually I am looking for uh, rev cloud Big, uh, yeah revision cloud see so revision cloud if you if you want to um, uh, get the revision cloud so you have to type the whole name so I'll, I'll bring it here so do not need to type it's only for professional people who is working like me or more than me less than me <laughs> okay so that was one another one is match properties match properties we have there but uh, if you need to bring match properties and sometimes it's hidden uh, from the main menu then you're gonna um, well, you can save some time if you have in your toolbar so MAT and uh, MATCH this is match properties so I'll click here and drag to my my toolbar <laughs> so right now I have three and what else I use uh, mm, okay for for right now this three is enough so I'm going to click apply and then I'm going to click OK and I'll click here this is something else and this is my toolbar 
is locked, I will unlock it. So here is unlocked and I'll just click and drag for example here. Just keep it here. Or if you want to click here, it doesn't matter. So just right click on this and take a look. They have a lot of toolbars. There is your my tools. Okay. So you can rename it also going there as uh, on the customize. So now I can put it on my right side or left side, wherever I want. And when I, while I'm working, for example, this is a line and for example, this is a rectangle and I want to wrap cloud this rectangle. So I just click here and start clouding. So this is very easy and very, very handy. I hope you guys enjoy. If you enjoy, if you want to subscribe or like the video comments, if you have a question, uh, comments below and uh, I'll get back to you. Thank you and enjoy your day.